The Trans Kalahari Corridor Cycling Challenge is one of the activities that were identified to commemorate 20 years since the signing of the Memorandum of Understanding, which established the TKC Management Committee as a Corridor Management Institute. During the welcoming event at City of Ventuk, the 30 cyclists from the three countries narrated the journey that started on the 16th of this month in Rustenburg in South Africa. 14 or 10 days along the road together. There's not, there's, I can write a book and I'm sure we will. I'm looking for a publisher. How we conquered the Trans-Kalahari Corridor on our bikes. It's really a pleasure having these beautiful faces coming to meet some crazy people that decide to ride from Rustenburg to Valsby. We appreciate you. The cycling initiative aims to raise awareness of the Trans-Kalahari Corridor regionally and internationally and secure member states' commitment to economic progress through spatial development initiative along the TKC. Uh, like I said, this was meant to be a commemoration, but a decision has been taken now that uh, we are going to have this annual. Now we're going to brand it as a cycling for the TKC. A cycling for the TKC. Uh, <laughs> yes. And have it as an annual uh, uh, activity. Uh, and we are hoping that next year uh, we, it will even be bigger than this. Uh, uh, this year we only chose. 10 cycles from Botswana, 10 from South Africa, and 10 from, from Namibia because of financial constraints. But uh, we are still going to plead with our sponsors that please, can they dig, dig deeper into their pockets to actually sponsor this noble uh, in, initiative. So, the city of Wunduk and its residents extend a very warm welcome and congratulate you on arriving here safely. You are an inspiration to us. All and we hope to see you more cyclists. The Trans Kalahari Corridor was established to simplify, harmonize, and govern the movement of people and goods. It will also promote deeper integration, harmonization of conflicting regulations and policies, enhance trade, logistics, improve quality service at minimal cost, and travel system of the three countries are but some. Recognizing the need to eradicate poverty and to place their countries on the path of sustainable economic development and growth, established through a memorandum of understanding the Trans-Kalahari Corridor Management Committee. This move was influenced by the need to achieve the transport and trade fa facilitation objectives and deeper regional integration as empowered by SACU, SADEC, and NEPAD. The cycling initiative is held under the theme Transforming the Trans-Kalahari Corridor into an Economic Corridor. Selima Henok, NBC News, Ventuk.